Here we go. Wow. So we have the branded versus the non-branded. Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm not even gonna go right into it because it's pretty self-explanatory. We're gonna be testing branded foods against non-branded Audi foods. And a few quick things I just wanna say. First of all, obviously I know that Audi is a brand, but I meant to do like branded as in like the expensive fancy brands and then I've got Audi's like bog standard everyday version. The second thing is obviously this isn't my idea. I've seen it flying around on YouTube for years and years. So hope you enjoy. I am so excited. I spent quite a lot of money on this on some food. Basically so Chloe's behind the camera and she's gonna give me the food in a different order. We've got some drinks and everything, so it's quite a fun time. And I have to guess which one is the branded one. I'm also gonna say which one I prefer. I'm ready for the first one, Chloe. You can have your pick. Okay, so we're starting off with the pepperoni. Now, I'm not actually good at the pepperoni, so I'm probably get this wrong. So, where is it? Wow. Oh, that is chunky. I thought pepperonis were skinnier than that. I think this is a pepperami. It doesn't feel like it. That feels fat. And then it is, that's the proper pepperami. And that's the, that's the branded, that's the unbranded, but I prefer that one. Ah, oh, I got it wrong. Didn't I? Yeah. Yeah. Oh gosh, they both look rank actually. <laughs> okay, so I'll give these to Jesse. He really wanted some. Okay, she's going for the McCoys. And the fake McCoy's flavour. Salt vinegar. I think I'm going to be quite good at this one. Who's fake Chris? A touch. Do you think that's cheating? Touch is cheating, isn't it? I don't know. That's so hard. That one's thicker, but that one's more vinegary. I can't remember if McCoy's are thick or not. That's the, that's the unbranded. That's unbranded. That's real McCoy's. And I prefer the real, the real deal, if it is real. That's really embarrassing, it's not. Knew it, I got the vinegar and I was like, that, that ain't it. That's not the McCoy's that I know. Yes, Grace won. We're going, next up is crackers. Cracker jacker. Okay, I'm ready. Okay. Very different in texture actually, aren't they? Right. I feel like that's Jacob's, but we can try it. Oh, it's so dry. They taste exactly the same. That one's that one's branded, and that one's unbranded. And I prefer that one. Yes. Literally, there, there's nothing in it. They taste very, very. It was just the flavour. There's like a Jacob's flavour. Do you know what I mean? Um. So far, I have liked one wrong. One wrong. But I have liked the branded more. But that's only when I'm pushed. The Jacob's cream crackers, you could not tell. The McCoys, you really could tell the texture. Wow, I've never had a crumpet in hot toasted. I'm not gonna lie. They taste exactly the same. Like, exactly. I'm just gonna gamble. I have no idea with this one. This is the branded, this is unbranded. And my favorite is this one. <laughs> I literally don't even know. Oh my gosh, I got it right! <laughs> this one is sourdough. Yeah, I know, but we can't. Oh, you get a little bit better. Next, we have Innocent Smoothie. Now, Innocent Smoothie, I feel like I'm gonna get right. Surely. Oh, please. Okay. Have you done them both? Yeah, there you go. That smells like innocent. It doesn't taste. I think that's innocent. You're not going to taste this one now and be like, oh no. That is unbranded. It has more texture. It's like not being as blended. I think I prefer this one and it's innocent. Ha <laughs> ha. That was good. Cheers. <laughs> Up next is cereal, which isn't actually one of my fortes. I do enjoy cereal, but I'm happy to have unbranded. <laughs> I do love the Jordan's Maple and Pecan Crunch, so I probably will get it. It's soggy, but I guess that's the milk. <laughs> oh, that's crunchier. Well, did you hear it? Yeah. Wait, that's unbranded, that. Wait, yeah, that's more sugary. Do you know how hard it is to eat with a spoon without seeing? That's branded, that's unbranded. I think I prefer the branded one. <laughs> I'm slaying this! Okay, let me just finish using it, we can put the crunchy nut in. I hate eating cereal on camera. There's something so gross about cereal eating. Oh, that one I can't tell. I'm gonna say that's branded, that's unbranded, and that one's my favorite better. 
because it has more, it's more crunchy and we learned from the last Audi cereal that they're very crunchy cereals, they retain their crunch. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I might invest myself, I'm not gonna lie, I did not think how to do this well. I don't think I'm gonna get biscuits right. I feel like biscuits, because I eat the fake ones, I never eat proper biscuits, do you know what I mean? So hard. How do they make it have the tea flavour? I'm not gonna get that right. That's too hard. Rich, branded, unbranded. And that one's my favourite because it's big, like thicker. Oh, I didn't get it right. Akira always has a stash of party rings from Aldi in her bag, so I feel like I should get this one. Oh, I don't bite them. I'm not going to suck them. That is so hard. They are identical. I can't even pick a favourite. I'm just going to say this one just because I like my right side. So this one's my favourite. Branded, unbranded. Completely no idea. Oh, I got it. Woo. Branded, unbranded. Oh, yeah, sorry. Yeah. They are identical in taste. Different in colour. Different in colour and size. But they um that's that was really hard. Now I can't remember what an Oreo feels like. They're both breaking a bit, aren't they? Oh right. It's so sandy. It's like you sand in your mouth. That one. That's real, that's fake. And that was my favourite. Knew it. What whoa, cheap first where they come from. Oh well, they're mine. Whoa. I really like them. Don't eat them all. Have yeah, a bowl. you shouldn't put them in there. Take a bowl. Mm, mm, mm. I can feel you. Oh, <laughs> where are you? <laughs> They're like slugs. I'm very orangey. That's a fake one. That's so orangey. That's naked. Naked have like a, a different taste. I'm just that. Naked have a different taste. They have like this little taste in the back of the throat. After you've eaten it, 100% that's naked. But I actually prefer this one. Brick. So these are the Nature Valley bars, and as we had these all the time when we were kids. So if I don't get this, I'm gonna be a disgrace to the booth name, because we used to have these all the time. I feel like this is a very clear one. It's gonna be, I think. I hate them 100% that's real. You feel quite on that. And it's so, yeah. Oh, no. I do not like that one. I do not like that one at all. This is branded and this is getting my vote. I, I'm like 100% confident. Oh, phew, I was right. I, I said it and then I was like, what if I take it off and it's not right? Last section, we're on to the sweets now. I'm really excited. Do they look oh, really similar? Have I got two ready? Yeah, you have. Oh! I think that's fake. That is... Oh. Oh, don't worry. <laughs> Oh my gosh, they're both really hard. Oh dear. Oh. For these ones, put you over there. <laughs> Is that what I mean? But I think these are the, wait, these are unbranded. These are branded, I prefer these. Mmm. Wow. So I prefer the fake ones. Yeah. That's, I hate fruit gums. Oh, oh my face. They're horrible. I gain nothing from that mouthful. Mm. And you put black currant. You know I don't like black currant. Fruit pastilles. Now this one I think is going to be clear. So like you. Right. The blindfold is going on. Two different flavors again. Or? Uh, just one maybe. Because they're quite big, aren't they? Hold on. Don't do anything yet. Not going to. Oh. They feel different. Unless that's a gammy one and you were trying to throw me off the scent and it was like a misshapen one. Because probably this is going to be the real one. Oh no! You tried to throw me off the scent. That is a fake fruit pastel. I don't remember them taste texture really being like that. That's a gammy one and you tried to throw me off the scent. Like, that's a fruit pastel. That texture. But that shape wasn't right. That's a fake one. I can tell from the texture. Well, also you picked lemon or something. Lime. And I don't like the taste. I prefer this texture. I don't like how soft that one is. I prefer this one, and this is the real one. This is the fake. You did try and... No, they like that. Oh, I thought they were like this shape. Yeah, they like that. They used to be. They are in the tube. I thought you were trying to do me dirty then. I was like, oh, right. oh, right. sit it down. And you picked lime, you little nasty. <laughs> I should have picked sweets I like. I don't like wine gums, fruit pastels, or fruit gums. 
Yeah, they're the worst. I've, they give me no joy, no personal gratification. I actually doesn't give much away. I don't, do they always have writing on? Oh yeah, they say like wine or something. I don't actually know what I'm looking for here. That's quite nice. That's quite pleasant, that taste. It's all right. That's real though, and that's fake. That's got more of a bite. Like the fruit pastels, the Aldi ones I feel like a soft gel. And they don't have that, that pull that I really like in a sweet. So they get my vote and that's branded. Wrong. Wrong. Ow. Who would have thunk it? Okay, so turns out I'll do the tally on screen and do a little debrief like I normally do. They all taste the same, basically branded and unbranded. There's a few things I should, if you want to do this again, I could do other supermarkets or I could do like proper like you know, chips, McCain chips versus Tesco chips or something like ketchup. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Hit like, comment, all that jazz. Round of applause for Chloe. I would give her a shout out on Instagram, but she does not care for that at all. And also, you don't need to do that until you've actually seen the footage. You'll realise that when you've been talking, I've been holding things up. Because <laughs> I've forgotten to say that you're talking. <laughs> Apologies. <laughs> Apologies, everyone. That is my videos, isn't it? If I was like a smooth editor, then it would have been. The communication wasn't clear. <laughs> So to debrief, the branded and unbranded foods aren't even that different considering there were only two that were different in how much I liked them or not. I'm annoyed that I didn't get full marks but what can you do, I'll just have to try another time with another supermarket. Anyway, it took me so long to edit this video and put all the pictures and whatnot in so I hope you do enjoy it. Let me know. Love you lots.